So a while back, my friend was going through a tough time and he came to me and he said, I'm trying to hear from God, but it doesn't seem like God's speaking to me. I'm waiting. I'm listening. I want to hear from him, but I don't seem to be hearing anything. Why isn't God speaking? And at some point, we've all been there. Or if we haven't, we will be at some point where we just go, man, is God there saying anything? Does God speak anymore? The, the good news is, yeah, he does. <laughs> he speaks through the Bible. Uh, 2 Timothy chapter 3 says, All scripture is inspired by God and is profitable for us. God is speaking to us through his word. But it also says that God speaks through the Holy Spirit. In John 14, it says that he'll guide us into all truth. In John 16, it says the Spirit will convict us of righteousness and truth. So God also speaks through the work of the Holy Spirit in our lives. Thirdly, it says he speaks through other people. That means preachers, teachers, parents, family, friends, all the wise counsel that we receive, that comes from God. And that's why Proverbs tells us not to neglect wise counsel, but to listen to it. Uh, scripture says that, that God is also working through our circumstances, sometimes to discipline us, sometimes to, to work in ways that we don't understand. But God is at work speaking to us through our circumstances. That's what happened with Joseph in the Old Testament. His brothers sold him into slavery and then through a series of, of unfortunate events, he ends up in jail and then he gets out of jail and he ends up rising up to the second in con command in Egypt and his brothers have to come because of a famine those brothers who had sold him out and what does he say to him he doesn't say ha ha now is my time to get you he says what you meant for evil God meant for good and God had been speaking through him through the circumstances of his life to show uh, who he was and what he was about and so God was working and, and speaking even there but all of these things ultimately lead us to one way that God speaks, and that is through his son, Jesus Christ. Hebrews chapter 1, verse 2 says that in these latter days, he has spoken through his son. That's why everything is meant to drive us towards that. Every circumstance we encounter, that's meant to drive us towards a greater understanding of Jesus as God wants to speak through him. The Holy Spirit is going to guide us towards Jesus. The scriptures guide us towards Jesus. Wise counsel is going to drive us towards Jesus. So anytime we go, oh man, is God really talking to me? Always look to Jesus. Always look to what the scripture says about Jesus. Always look to what the Holy Spirit is telling you about Jesus. Because that is the way that God speaks first and foremost and above all.